Friday edition. It's a lunch of time edition spotting TPA, a smorgasbord of aviation delight. Appreciate you being on board. Let's get right into the aviation action. Delta 28, 2829 from the frozen tundra of Antarctica, MSP, Minneapolis, St. Paul. One, two, four, eight to New York's LaGuardia A320 service. Holy smokes, look what's over there. Is that coming over here? National? Oh, this has got to be a charter. What's it doing? Oh, don't tell me it's taken off on the other side, on the left side. I'll kiss my sink. How can I miss this? Son of a gun. Another heavy back to back. 3490 from BWI. Prime Air. What? No winglets? Not much in the way of any breeze this morning, or this 
high noon edition of spotting. Oh gang, it's super thanks, super shout out time here at TPA. Special thanks to Laron Woods. Laron, thank you for supporting the channel. Truly appreciated, my friend. If you'd like to uh, support the channel as well, check out the Super Thanks icon. Back to the aviation action we go. Well, the Prime team is ready for the 767 to come on in. While well, the 76 is going to sneak in, we've got a 757 pushing back. Departing E62. Parking. 2211 was cleared, but they needed a few seconds 
And there's an Airbus on final, so they got to hold up and wait a minute. They are going to let him go. Traffic is on a four and a half mile fi final. We got 2211 non stop service to ATL. The world! Busy at airport. And let's talk to the tech manager. International airport. Every time I ride on a 7.5, it's like a roller coaster. Put you back in your seat with those high thrust engines. Put on my road external mic with the dead cat. And there's a uh, APU in the background and construction noise. Hoping to muffle some of that out. Hey, hey. They didn't say if they saw birds or not, or I didn't hear it. I'd say that truck is a little bit lost. Should not be on airport road. <laughs> Jeez. He's looking for the car the rental car center, I'm sure. Deltas. 459 the latte special yep copycatting alaska tpa to seattle tacoma international tampa international's longest domestic flight five and a half hours five hours 45 minutes a lot of fuel on this 737 800 I'm betting wall of shame. How about you? And be sure to tell the truth. Are you guessing yes or no? They've been cleared. Oh, this is turning into a United special. Ones you're picking up. Helps cool things down a little bit. Yeah, I was ready to come at 5.30 this morning. The weather report said uh, northern option later in the afternoon around 2 o'clock. The wind will shift. Chance of rain. And two hours later, they had the whole new report out. Oh, 
crap. I lost that bet big time. All right, who, who guessed that it would clear the wall of shame? Be honest. Raise your hands. I can see you out there. That was impressive with all that fuel. Yeah, and I'm, when I'm not watching planes, we got Tonka toys. Take a scoop and run. Alright, who had these as little kids? I did. Front end loader, how cool. If you've never had an endoscopy, it kind of looks like this. You got the doctor, the anesthesiologist, and the nurse. And they put the tube in the wear. Well, what did you have for lunch today? I brought wieners. Celery salt. A little over a thousand miles for thirteen fifty six to wing its way to New York to LaGuardia. See that Iberia flight to Spain where they never took any of the passengers luggage they arrived nothing ever came on the conveyor belt three days later last I heard they still hadn't seen their luggage it was never moved from uh, when they checked it in that would be a bummer huh it's here again two days in a row Oh, this is going to be, I thought it was going to be a flat landing. We saw this crazy silverbird in yesterday's video. From Cuba. Mad Dog MD-83. The silverbird. I forgot to look up where this originally came from. This US Air American. Doral? Is that the call sign? Doral? Oh, it's the Dusal Falcon 2000. I can never say it right. Destination given. Well, if you haven't seen yesterday's video, you got to check it out. Cessna Citation going vertical. Crazy, crazy, crazy. New York's LaGuardia for Southwest 2034. 1,010 miles, I think, is what it is. 1,015, something like that. Two hours, maybe a couple ticks over that. Oh, 
we've got an international flight coming up here in a minute or two. Hey, we got planes, trains, and automobiles. 962 to BDL, Windsor Locks, Connecticut. I think there's another one before our international flight. What's going on? Got a lot of traffic down there. Well, I hope your weekend is going great. This will come out Saturday morning. 2912, the wind 0806, rolling on the right. Clear pickup. Pickup, 198 right, American 2912. Charlotte! CLT for 2912, Airbus service. And I think finally next will be our international flight. give you a hint 1655 is from is from is our neighbors to the north air canada's rouge say it with me rouge a320 service to y y z toronto california toronto california toronto canada i can't believe that came out of my mouth i can't believe what comes out of my mouth these days Red white. Oh, Canada. They got a great anthem. Oh, tower. 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 Thank you. Who's this? Is that the Phenom that landed a few minutes ago? A lot of planes have to land here, exec jets, to go through customs if they're an international flight and they take right off again. Thirteen eighty five to the TWA Hotel, New York's JFK, President Kennedy's Airport. from CAC, C-A-K, Akron, O-I-O. -O. Flight number, well, I can remember this one, one, two, three. And yep, it's one of their new A220s. I'll be flying on it. A220-100, this is a 300 variant, bigger. We'll be flying it from SJC, San Jose, California, to Salt Lake City. Check 
Challenger 300. The wind is starting to come a little more northerly. So it's east northeast now, but we're still taking off south. about to say they look a little high and there's also a exec jet on the runway and a citation still on the runway just turning off now Going around, going around, going around. Oh, it looks like it's going down. Well, they said the reason was unstable. They didn't get to do enough S-turns. I thought it was because the, the uh, aircraft's still on the runway. But they looked really high all along. four from Austin, that's southwest. They almost look a little high too. And they're dropping pretty fast now. A little long on the touchdown, but not a problem. Just a tad hot. A lot of reverse action going on there. I'm not saying when wind is one zero zero. Feels more like eight zero to me. Well, we've got a lot of exec jet action the last 48 hours.
Well, second time's a charm. 11.92. They look in fine shape this time. Captain Neo. Eighty-one from IAH. Yep, Houston for United. Going to see a lot of United in November when we take the show to SFO. <laughs> Didn't want to miss that turn off. That next one is all the way down the end. The pink plane, our flamingo buddy. Correct term is fuchsia. Not pink. ATR. 42, 600. It's the Dell's Lemonade Special. 1040 to PVD, Providence, Rhode Island. for our flamingo buddy to Charles excuse me to Charleston CHS Yards are a real workhorse boy. Keep ticking and ticking and ticking and ticking and ticking. Could be interesting. Twenty-three ninety-eight. 
737 MAX 2 IAD. And in the trees. I think. Aha! Uh -huh. I'm just about to say, I think I said 2398 and they said 2393, and it is 2398. I'm right again. Woo! Twice in one day. Well, the KC 135 staring us in the face. That's going to conclude this edition of Spotting Tamp International. Appreciate you being on board. If you're new to the channel, welcome! Thrilled to see you here as well. Hope you'll take a moment, smash that subscribe button, like, share, and hit the notification bells. We upload daily. Yeah, you don't want to miss a single episode, trust me. And if you'd like to support the channel, check out the super thanks icon. And as always, we'll see you again tomorrow on another edition of Spotting. Tampa International!